Hey, what's up, guys? My name is Switcher T Scored, and today I'm bringing you guys my first gameplay on Advanced Warfare. This was actually the first game I ever played on Advanced Warfare, so that's pretty cool. I meant to do a live com over my first game that I played, except I was playing this at like. I don't know, like midnight and stuff, and I didn't want to wake up my family, so I decided to just record some videos, and then just kind of do the commentaries later, so right now, guys, I'm already like level 40, I played the first night the game came out, I played for, I don't know, maybe like 3 hours or so, and I'm level like 40 or 37 or something like that, I have like a 1.5 KD right now, and I'm still just trying to learn the maps, and just kind of learn which guns are the best to use, and everything like that. And for today's video, I just want to tell you guys kind of my first impressions on the game and everything. Uh, I'm honestly so excited this game is out, by the way. I've been waiting so long for Advanced Warfare. I was really looking forward to Call of Duty Ghosts last year, and then that game just really wasn't, you know, my fancy. I didn't really enjoy Call of Duty Ghosts. It wasn't that fun. I didn't enjoy playing the game, really, and I mostly just played MW3 and Black Ops 2, like, the last year or two. So I'm so glad there's finally a new game that I can play. It feels fresh. It's unlike any Call of Duty game, and I think that's awesome. You guys will see in this first game, I didn't really know the maps at all. I didn't know really how to play and stuff. Now, I know most of the maps already, and I'm kind of just playing more fast-paced and just uh, rushing around and stuff. In this first game, I didn't really know what I was doing. And by the way, right Right now, guys, my, high, my highest kill streak is a 15. I actually got a 15 gun streak, so that's pretty cool. I'll post that sometime soon for you guys. I'm going to try to post a lot of uh, kind of like tips and tricks videos and just kind of like learning the game, like learning kill streaks, learning the maps, and learning which guns are good to use and stuff. I have a lot of just kind of tips and tricks videos and like how to get gold camo. How to get this, how to get that, and things like that. So, by the way, in this game, I went 19-9 and nine in my first game, which is just over a 2KD. I thought that was pretty good. And uh, I was playing 6v6 TDM on the map Defender. I really like this map. This is the map I got my 15 gun streak on. And I also got my only ever 10 gun streak on this map. So, my two highest gun streaks so far are on this map, Defender. It's based in San Francisco. And I think midway through the game, there's like a big tsunami and it kind of alters the map. I think that's really cool. This is probably my favorite map so far. This map, and then Riot, and then uh, I forget this one map. It's Solar, Solar. So, Riot, Solar, and uh, this map, Defender. Those are my three favorite maps in the game so far. I think there's maybe like 12 maps, maybe, I'm not quite sure, that's just kind of my guess, but uh, in this game, I did pretty good, 19-9, I thought that was pretty good for my first game, I don't know how long the double XP lasts, I think it might be double XP for like this first week, or maybe this upcoming weekend or something, but... I'm honestly level 40 already from only playing for like 3 hours, so that's pretty crazy. I'm gonna start on my Road to Commander account as well. I'm just trying to do some kind of intro videos and play on my main account before I start a Road to Commander. By the way, there's 50 levels in the game for those of you guys who are wondering. Every Call of Duty game is different. Uh, MW3 had like 80 levels. MW2 had 70 levels, Black Ops 1 had 50 levels, and this game has 50 levels, so uh, just in case you guys didn't know, there's 50 levels, and then you can prestige, and I believe there's 15 prestiges as well, so there's kind of your prestige info, I guess. In this game, I was using the BAL-27 Assault Rifle. It's pretty much the only gun that I've used so far. I have like five or 600 kills, and I think it said 340 of my kills were with this gun. And then I also have like 150 kills with the AK-12, so this gun's really good. It's the first gun you start out with. A lot of people online are playing with this gun right now, and I think it's pretty good to be honest. I have all the attachments unlocked for this gun already. I tend to use uh, stock, red dot sight, and then uh, either suppressor or quick draw, I guess. I kind of just switch between those, and I really like this gun. The, the damage is pretty good, the range is decent. And it's just a pretty good gun to use. It reminds me of like the G36C from MW3. So that's just kind of my uh, relation, I guess. Uh, right there, you guys can see I was already level 5, like midway through this first game. It's pretty easy to rank up when you first start playing and it's double XP. So hopefully I'll be able to prestige quickly. And then I'll probably start on my Road to Commander account and bring some videos for you guys. I just want to tell you guys my first impressions really fast. I want to say this game is honestly so fun, and I'm not just saying that because it's the new game. Uh, it's unlike any other Call of Duty game. In every other game, it's kind of just like you play it on the ground, like Black Ops 2, MW3, Black Ops 1, 
all the older games are just played on the ground. And this game is so new, there's like verticality in this game because of the boost jumps and all the exo abilities and stuff. You can hover in midair, you can boost jump and jump on top of high buildings. And I think that's really, really fun. It makes the game more challenging. It's not like as simple as MW3 where you can kind of just strafe around corners. You have to jump onto buildings and kind of jump around and stuff. But I think it's so fun so far. I honestly love this game. I've played it for a few hours, and I've totally enjoyed this game. I just hope that uh, the game lasts a long time. There's only about 10 kill streaks in the game, and there's not that many maps, so I hope the DLC is really good. Uh, hopefully there's like DLC weapons, and hopefully there's a lot of good DLC maps and stuff like that. But uh, this game's really fun so far, guys. If you haven't already bought this game, I definitely recommend you go buy it. Uh, it's probably my favorite Call of Duty game ever, to be honest. MW3 is really fun because of going for Moabs and having Specialist Bonus and Stalker, but this game, guys, it honestly doesn't feel like Call of Duty. Uh, this is like the 11th Call of Duty game, I believe, and it really just feels like a brand new game, and I'm honestly loving this game. It's so fun to jump around and jump on objects and stuff. I've always wanted a Call of Duty game that kind of had that verticality aspect, so... Hopefully you guys enjoyed this gameplay today. I only went 19 and 9. I have like a 26 kill TDM and I also have a 15 gun streak that I'll try to post for you guys. Hopefully you enjoyed the video today. I just wanted to tell you guys my first impressions. Peace out guys.